Hello everyone, I am very happy to say that the Steam page for Color War is officially up. Link is in the description, or if you want, you can just search up Color War on Steam and you'll be able to find it. And why not give it a wishlist? Anyway, uh, let's get into the video. So I've gotten a lot of feedback since putting out the demo, and I really appreciate everyone who's taken the time to play it and give me their opinions. If you haven't, you can find the demo in the description, but I spent some time fixing up the things that people had issues with. For example, the biggest challenge for me making this game is the art. I'm not an artist by any means, so perspective isn't something that really comes naturally to me. The biggest examples of this change come with me yeeting the rock textures, as well as making the bridges visually make more sense. I'm sure this perspective is going to be a constant challenge for me, so please feel free to call out any inconsistencies or oddities in the design. Okay, so I've actually changed a lot with these. Where applicable, I've made it more obvious where attacks are going to be coming from. I've made it so not only does your health scale with difficulty, but the amount of time you can't get hit for between attack scales as well. In the future, I'm planning on adding some kind of health display, as well as maybe some kind of duration bar for the boss, but not really sure yet. I've done my best to flesh out Chris's story, as well as including the explanation for the goat's head adventure. If you've already played it and want to check out the newer stuff, I've updated the demo so you can do so. I've created a sign that pops up showing when you can interact with something. It's not a perfect solution, but it's what I'm going to have for now. Okay, uh, moving on. So after you talk with the ghost dude, he's going to take you to the first real color faction, the Crystal Blue Faction. This is where you'll encounter Kirstel, the Geo General, and her henchmen as well as meet a bunch of cool people that live in the caves. This is going to feature new colors in the color palette for the first time, which I hope will make it visually interesting, as well as having a strong focus on character development of not only the main character, but the henchmen in general as well. If you've been checking out the streams I've been doing, you've seen some of this stuff and maybe even helped with it. And if you haven't, go ahead and hit that bell button so you can catch them when I go live, as well as subscribing and wishlisting Color War on Steam. My mom once told me that if you don't wishlist Color War on Steam, you're not epic, and I've taken that to heart. You should too. I just want to say again how happy I am for the success that not only this channel is seen, but the Color War demo. There's just been so much positive feedback from everyone, and I really appreciate it. I know that a lot of the people watching are aspiring game devs themselves, and I just want to say how important having this kind of community has been for me, because not only has it helped me stay motivated, it's helped me meet new people and have fun doing it. So, I really appreciate all of you watching. Also, as I'm recording this, we've actually hit 300 subscribers and are past that, so big thank you. Big thank you to everyone who subscribed. Alright, later nerds.